Well, what's up, everybody? Jonathan here with NLA Gaming, and today we're back with another mod review. And today we're going to be checking out the Caterpillar 555D by Wood Meadow Farms. Uh, if you remember from Farming Simulator 17, I think this was actually done by somebody else, but for 19, uh, Wood Meadow Farms took it and retooled it, you know, to make it work in 19. <clears throat> and this is a it's a very nice mod. Uh, I'm really liking it so far. Of course, it's a grapple skitter. Uh, there is going to be a winch on here eventually. It's not on here yet. This is the beta version. Um, and I wish they would do something a little different with the windows. They, those kind of look funny. I'm not sure what's what it is, but maybe it's just the 19 uh, sunshine or something hitting it weird. But the windows look a little strange, but anyway, uh, th this does come in uh, with chains. Let me show you that real quick. So if you go to forestry machines and <clears throat> the um, Caterpillar 555D skitter, you get you get it with chains, no extra cost. Uh, oh, it's got a top speed of 293 miles an hour. Wow. <laughs> but uh, yeah, super nice, super nice mod. All right, and uh, I, I don't prefer the chains, so I'm not running chains on here. But I've been kind of testing this out a little bit, and so far it's pretty nice. I mean, it's like most grapple skitters in you know 17 or even 15. Uh, you can't really get more re reliably more than about two logs in the grapple. If uh, you start getting more than that, they they'll start slipping out. But uh, let's let's hop in the skitter and take a look. Uh, of course, you got your outside view and the inside view. And I'm, yeah, there's not a grapple cam or anything. You have to just turn around. Be nice if there was a grapple cam. You know, like maybe kind of you know outside view, like kind of off to the side or something. That'd be kind of neat. But yeah, um, Wood Meadow Farm stated that the, you know, of course this is a beta and they're going to be putting out a winch uh, on the I guess the full release. But anyway, I kind of wanted to check this out. Of course, it's got the, you know, working uh, blade on the front, and then of course the grapple you know, on the back. But uh, and uh, my my game controller's getting kind of worn out. I probably need a new one here pretty soon. But so the guy's kind of funny. But let's let's crank this thing up. And see what it sounds like. Okay, so the top speed of this thing is 11 miles an hour, which is about right. Seems about right. And uh, I've got a, a big pile of trees over here I was kind of messing around with earlier. So if you call it my, my video series on Grizzly Mountain, you probably know uh, what I was doing with this. I was testing out the Big Bud skitter. But anyway, so the, it's a dual arch grapple. Um, so you get the, the top part that goes up and down. And you got this, uh, let's see, where is it? Oh, I guess it's this way, yeah. So the top part goes up and down, and the whole thing back and forth. Alright, come on. And my game controller's uh, not going to cooperate too good. And I probably didn't pick it up right either. Anyway, you know, like, like I said, most most grapple skitters in this game, you know, you're you're doing good to get uh, two, maybe three logs in the grapple, and then four is like ultra rare. <laughs> But anyway, I'm, I'm, I'm really liking this grapple skitter so far. Uh, it seems to be doing pretty well. I'm probably going to use it in some gameplay, and then of course whenever the final version comes out, I will uh, of course use that. But anyway, I just want to make a quick video to let you guys know that this is out now, uh, and how you get to it is 
Uh, one way is, well, I guess the only way right now is uh, to go to uh, the Woodmeadow Farms Patreon page. You don't have to be, you don't, you don't have to donate or anything. He's got got the link up there for free. You can download it, no cost. And um, but also, I would encourage you to go over to his uh, Facebook page and check it out over there. It's uh, Woodmeadow Farms, but I think actually where he's got all his mod and stuff, I believe it's WMF Modding. I'll, I'll try to remember to put a, a link in the description below. But anyway, so far this, this beta version is working out pretty good. I like it. I wonder, I was going to look and see here if there's any options. Uh, yeah. Because remember, I think it was in uh, Farming Simulator 17 on this machine here. I think if you hit the Z key, it would change between chains. Yeah. So I guess you have to buy them in the store, and it's, they're either on or off. There's no in between. see maybe if we could get that third tree in there but they have to be laying just right I think and usually what I've found when you try to get uh, three trees in there is it'll be fine for a while until you start taking some corners or some sharp turns and they'll slip out. So there's one trying to slip out, but I don't think I have my grapple. Yeah, I guess it's, it is all the way tight. Yeah, it's just the physics of these trees, plus I got one trying to come through the arch back there. <laughs> so Anyway, you can maybe sometimes get three trees, but I wouldn't count on skidding them any long distance and they sticking in there. These things seem to be working pretty good though. And it's like one's that third one over there is trying to slip out. But anyway, those of you that have played a lot with this game and grapple skidders, you know what's what's up with those, so nothing new. But anyway, yeah, so I just wanted to kind of test this out a little bit. I'm really liking it so far. Uh, oh, yeah, I was going to speed up time, too, so we could look at the uh, lights. So let's do that. Let's uh, see if we can get it dark here pretty soon. That's pretty dark. Let's see what we got in here for lights. Alright, so you got the front, which is actually pretty bright. And slow that back down. And then you got the uh, the, the front and the rear, so the next button, or next button press. And then there's one more option here that's like, <laughs> get the side lights, and it lights up the whole night. <laughs> so that's cool, I like that. Lots of, you can see a good distance quite bright. So I do like that. Yeah, I like that. Alright everybody, well that's going to do it for this mod review and uh, I would highly recommend checking this out. This is a very nice mod. It looks super nice and uh, looks like it uh, functions pretty well. Uh, looks like there's maybe a few little tweaks to make. Like I said, I'd, I'd like to see the, the the windows look a little different. I'm not, I'm not quite sure what's going on with that, but I don't know. I'd almost like them to be tinted. That'd be cool. Um, and then, like I said, the uh, the winch is going to be added in there later from what I was reading. Uh, but yeah, really, that's it. I mean, I like it. It's a good mod. So uh, yeah, definitely go check that out. 
And like I say, go support the uh, Woodmeadow Farms Facebook page, but give them a like over there. And then you can uh, go to patreon.com slash WMF modding will get you to the Patreon page where you can download this beta and check it out. So anyway, hope you enjoyed this mod review and uh, go check it out. And we'll see you later. Thanks for watching.